In this short tutorial, we are gonna fix the XGI error device hung to finance problem. Before moving on to the video, don't forget to leave a like. I recommend watching the video once before trying new solutions. The first solution is to optimize our computer for the finance. Since the exact cause of the problem is unclear, we will start by optimizing our PC for the finance. The first thing we need to do is to set Steam to run as admin. To do this, right click on Steam and click open file location. After that, right click on Steam again and open properties. Click on compatibility from the top and click run this program as an admin. After that, click apply and OK. The next thing we need to do is to clear the finance cache files. To do this, we go to search and open run. After opening run, Type percent local up data percent in the search bar and click OK. In the folder that opens, we find the discovery folder and delete it. Deleting this folder will not damage the game. The third step is to set the finance to high performance. To do this, we go to search and type graphic settings. After opening graphic settings, click browse to add our game. We need to navigate to the file location of the finance. To do this, click on this PC. Then, double click on the disk where Steam is installed. If we installed Steam on C, the Steam folder will be in the program files x86 folder. After finding the Steam folder, double click on it. Then open Steam apps. After doing this, double click on common and the finals. Then we select discovery and click add. Click browse again and open the discovery folder. Then double click on binaries and bin64. Then we add discovery here in the same way. It didn't add it because I did it before, but you shouldn't have any problems. We have added the finals. Now we are gonna set it to high performance. To do this, click on options and select high performance. Click save and close here. We do the same for the other the finals. We set the finals to high performance. The next thing we need to do is to toggle off game bar. To do this, click on gaming on the left and then click on game bar. After doing that, we toggle off game bar. The last thing we need to do is turn off Windows Defender. The reason we do this is because the firewall can prevent the game from running. To turn off the firewall, we go to search section and open control panel. After opening control panel, click on system and security and click on Windows Defender Firewall. After doing this, click Turn Windows Defender Firewall on or off on the left side. Then we turn off the firewall. This was the first solution. Now you can check if the problem is solved or not. If the problem is not solved, we will move on to the second solution. Also, don't forget to like the video if you haven't already. The second solution is to do the necessary updates. The problem may be caused by the outdated Windows or graphics card. To update Windows, right click on the Windows icon and then open settings. After opening settings, click on Windows update and then check for updates. To update our graphics card, we go to search and open the program of our graphics card. Then we click on drivers and if we need to update our graphics card, we update it. I have shown this process for NVIDIA, but if you are using a different graphics card, what you need to do is the same. The last step of the second solution is to download the necessary DLL libraries. The problem may be due to missing DLL files on our computer. There are two programs we need to download. The first program is DirectX. We open our browser and type DirectX download in the search bar. Then we open Microsoft's site and download DirectX. There will be a download link in the description. You can go to the download page from there if you want. The second program we need to download is Visual C++. In the same way, we open Microsoft's site again. Then we scroll down and click X64. We have downloaded the programs we need to download. Now we are going to install these programs. Click on Direct X and tick I accept the agreement. Click Next and Continue. Untick Install the Bing Bar and click Next again. Click Finish and close the tab. We install the other program in the same way. 
Now, we need to restart our computer. After that, you can check if the problem is solved or not. If the problem persists, we will move on to the last solution. The last solution is to verify our system and game files. The problem could be caused by corrupt system or game files. So, we will verify these files. To verify our system files, we go to search and run cmd as admin. There are three codes we need to type in cmd. You can copy these codes from the description section. These codes will not cause any damage to our computer. We type the first code and press enter. In the same way, we type the second code. Finally, we type the third code. This will take some time because our system files are verified. We have verified our system files. Now, we will verify our game files. To do this, we open Steam. Because we changed Steam's compatibility settings in the first solution, we get a notification like this. To avoid getting this notification every time, we took Do Not Show again and click Continue. After opening Steam, click on Library and right-click on the Finals. After that, click Properties and then click Installed Files. Then we click Verify. We have verified the files of the finals. Now, you can check if the problem is solved or not. We have come to the end of the video. I hope one of these solutions fixed your problem. If the video helped you, don't forget to like the video. You can also subscribe to my channel to support me. Take care and see you in the next video.